Hello and welcome to a kind of allnewstuff.tv vidcast. This week we've got a brand new feature for you that we're calling Verses. And first to do battle on netbooks. First up, I've got Samsung's N230, which I think is a pretty safe bet. Now Samsung have gone for nice and simple when it comes to design, but like most netbooks, this thing loves your fingerprints. Now at £340, it is pricey in netbook terms, but your money will get you a solid and comfortable keyboard, a brilliant reflection-free matte screen, and a rather nice brushed metal palm rest. And it has a huge eight-hour battery life. But like its life, the battery itself is also huge and looks pretty ugly sticking out at the back. A much cooler design touch are its unusual chrome hinges. And when it comes to connectivity, there's few surprises, but we love that one of the USB ports can be used to charge your gadgets, even when it's switched off. The N230 is tough enough to handle day-to-day -day tasks such as web browsing and streaming online video, but tougher tasks such as video editing or opening up a load of applications will cause its little processor to struggle. So all in all, the Samsung is a brilliant all-round netbook, mixing up a decent build quality with some pretty awesome features. Asus started the whole netbook revolution and the EPC 1018P looks set to build on that heritage. It manages to blend solid build, slick design and a budget price tag. The keyboard is comfortable to type on and the screen is sharp and bright. Though unlike the N230, it is reflective so expect to see more of your reflection than maybe you'd like. The collection of ports and connections are pretty standard, but like the N230, it too sports an unusual feature. The EPC has a cover for the webcam, which slides across when you don't want to be seen. But be warned, this doesn't turn the webcam off so people will still be able to hear what you're up to. It also struggles with heavy duty use and despite giving it many chances, we just couldn't stop full screen 720p videos stuttering during playback. The 1018P ensures that Asus stays near the top of the netbook pile. And while we would have preferred its near five hour battery life to be a little bit longer, it still manages to hold its own amongst the new netbook contenders. But as good as the EPC is, it's Samsung's N230 that comes out on top. It's nailed the balance between portability and usability, and it's a solid all-round netbook, and one that's certainly worthy of that slightly hefty price tag.